Hey friends, my name is Steven with Leviathan Snakes and for this week's micro marketing tip, we wanted it to be a little bit different than what we normally do, um, kind of in a negative way, but we're gonna try not to be negative and we're gonna talk about one of my pet peeves. So if you're interested to hear what I kind of think about in a negative fashion for micro marketing tips, stay tuned. Different marketing topic, but one pet peeve that I have when I see other people's marketing. One is people who do not realize that the content you produce on social media is a direct reflection of both themselves, their business, and their animals. Okay, so it's a pet peeve of mine because I feel like some people approach social media like it's not real. Like that the people on there just don't actually exist. And it's so weird to me because we will see people do things that they would never do in real life just because it's like, un it's an unheard of like social dynamic. I don't want to like call out anybody because that's not, we don't like being negative. And that's, all right, no, that's actually a, a important point. So one thing is I believe in putting out like essentially positive vibes and it's you want to help people get better and you want people to help you get better and you want to add happiness to the world and value to the world. And the problem with it is that often the most engaging content is negative and we, I fall into this myself sometimes, all the time, like all see something that is negative or it's essentially drama in nature and it catches my interest way more often than the people who are praising others and it's it's bad and it's there's not really anything that we can like actually do except for make a deliberate effort to put out just positiveness so when you are using social media to market your business if you can have a reputation of being kind and being positive and lifting up others it's going to help i i 100 percent believe that if people know that you are willing to help them they will be willing to help you and this doesn't necessarily mean that just because somebody reshared our post that that means that they are going to go buy a snake from us that's not that's not it's not doing it for an ulterior motive when you are doing social media and you're sharing sharing somebody's content liking their content leaving a comment following them if you are only doing it so that way you can get some sort of personal return on that action that's the only reason why you're doing it you're probably going to end up getting discouraged and if you get discouraged, you just end up quitting. Maybe not quitting breeding ball pythons, but you'll feel like that social media isn't worth it overall. Um, so that's that's one thing. A pet peeve of mine when it comes to social media stuff is people who are so negative that they only put out negative content and just kind of takes other people down. And I don't wish that it wasn't something that was so prevalent on social media. And that's one reason why we like Instagram so much. Instagram is probably our favorite um, reptile community of any of the social media platforms. 